welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Elaine, but you can always call me Ellie. And today I have two boxes to unbox. One is the Lumicrate box and the other one is the Bookish box that I got like two days ago. I wanted to do it together that way I don't have to do that many videos for different boxes because I have a lot of ideas for these upcoming weeks and um, I think that this should be only one video. So we're going to go quickly through them and yeah, let's begin. So first let's do the Illuminate one. I'm really excited about this one. I do not know what the book is going to be. Um, so yeah, I hope that it's good. I must say that um, January, February have been so good. So I am, I have high expectations when it comes to Illuminate. The first we have, ooh, okay, so uh, this. And um, it looks like a book. <laughs> I think this is something where you can put your pencils in or I don't know, like bookmarks and that kind of stuff. I really like the color yellow for this. And I, I just think that it would be so good to have like a lot of different um, colors for this item and put them like in a mini bookcase. That, that should be so beautiful. The topic of this month is going to be nothing but thieves. Next I have ooh, something really beautiful. It looks like a book. No, it's not a book. It's like a... Oh, okay. Look at this. I don't know if... I, I don't think that the camera makes it justice. I don't know. I don't think... Can you all see the blue flowers i think that the blue flowers are even better than the actual foil detail oh and i think this is like an album to put our prints i think that i do actually really like a lot this item i don't know if everyone is like me but since i was really small i have always loved to have photographs um, on paper like print them and have them in albums. I have so many albums, so many photographs. I think that yes you should definitely live in the moment but also when you look back um, or when you look at the photographs you can remember the things that you lived and the people and I don't know I just like prints photograph better than have them in a computer. Next we have this pepper craft kit. Uh, you take those pieces and then you put them all together. And I think this is a nice pastime. It's like a puzzle. Okay, next we have book bookmarks. Yeah, we have bookmarks with different characters. I think we have one, two, three, four, five, five bookmarks and with all of these characters which if i'm being honest i do not know what the characters are from give me just one second okay gilded walls bookmark set yeah so you have like five bookmarks i love them i love the illustrations i think they're really pretty I don't know which one is my favorite. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, I I do know. I do know which one is my favorite. This one definitely. He's so dark and awesome. And this one, cause he has beautiful eyes. Like, come on. Now let's look at the book. Finally, I feel like this box was not. I don't know as great. <laughs> That's my opinion, but. Yeah, I don't even see the um, author's letter or anything like that. Maybe it's inside of the book. Nope. No, it's not inside of the book. Yeah. So this is the book. Um, it's okay, I guess. This is the book. Portrait of a Thief by Grace D. Lee. Um, I don't know. I like it. I do like the cover. It's kind of... 
and these are the edges not that impressive I do not really like that tone of yellow I'm not um, very keen on yellow it has to be like a really like a pretty yellow not this one this one looks like just highlighter like someone took a highlighter and drew the edges it doesn't have any end papers okay let's see the jacket okay so it has a reversible jacket I think that this art in the reversible jacket should be the end papers because the truth is that sometimes sadly jackets get lost or they tear apart or they get um rough here so sometimes you change the jackets but if you have the art inside of the book you can definitely open the book and see the art here i think that is one of the great things about end papers and creative end papers that you will always that's the first thing that you will see when you open a book and this is the naked hardcover nothing special um it has a lot of tigers i'm guessing um, in foiled, in gold foiled, but um, I don't think this is like really well done because the margins are in one side too far away, like not from here to here, but from here to here. I, I, I really like the book. I'm not gonna say, I'm, I'm gonna read it. Um, I do not expect Illumicrate to be always fantasy because they're not a fantasy uh, book box like fairy loot but um, I don't know I think this is new for them um, I do not remember a time where I got like a book like this kind of book in Illumic Crate but yeah it's not like I don't like it it's okay and I'm really excited to read it okay and now let's do this um, bookish book box and this is the box, nothing special. It only has like one label over here where it shows you the company, I guess. Okay, so first we have this, which is, I'm guessing, a candle, because they almost always send you a candle. And, oh, I like this. So this is a candle with the Aries um, Zodiac sign illustration. I love this. That's nice. Next, this is the trope book display. Oh, I love the design. Okay, so it's this, and it should be like this. And you open this in the back, and you just put it on the, I guess, height that you want. And you put the book in here with either the pages open or just like this. I think this one is a very good item for reading sometimes you get tired um, holding like hardbacks for example like hardcover um, books and you can always put it here and you don't need to use your hands so let's see what we have here in this bag oh this is a bookmark <gasps> this is beautiful kingdom of the course oh this is so beautiful. This is a bookmark. Look at that. Come in, come in here. I've seen that in TikTok. But this is a bookmark that I'm not gonna use. <laughs> I'm never gonna use this bookmark. I'm just going to, can you see a better one? I put it against my hair. Oh, against the light. I think the light is better with a black background. Um, but I'm never gonna use this. I'm going to place it in my book case and never use it. That way it doesn't break. Next we have this Kingdom of Ruins necklace. And I think it's really cute. Can you see it because of the light? We also have another bag. Jolly Hogwall Serpent. So this is a serpent that you put, that you place on the wall like this and then you can put like your necklaces and bracelets I'm guessing I have a couple of necklaces that I could use these for but I'm not going to 
put it in my wall. I don't know. I maybe I do. We have this beautiful art print that is beautiful. I would love to have that hair color, but my hair is so black <laughs> that I'm never going to be able to unless I bleach and I'm not going to bleach my hair again. That's another story. Um, but yeah, she's so beautiful. She's even more beautiful than him. Okay, finally we have the book. Ooh. So let's open it. No. Okay, so this is what happens. Um, it has never happened to me because I think that Illuminate and Fairy Loot they never do the same book. But I think I think Bookish Bookish does. So I have this book already. I think it came either on the Fairy Loot or Illuminate box I do not remember and it is the UK edition hardcover design so I guess I love it because it is a different design and this one is purple instead of red which is the regular one from the US the uh, US cover and I don't know I really like it and I don't know if you remember but when I did the battle the US uh, this UK cover battle I did said that I did say that I did indeed prefer this cover better because it gave me more information and really this purple color is so beautiful I love it I really like it this one doesn't have any stencil edges it's just sprayed all the whole way okay so it is signed the end papers are just like beautifully done but they don't have any characters or anything like that but it's signed they also have this beautiful illustration inside of the book which is one of the things that I really enjoyed about bookish box is that they put a lot of illustrations inside of the book which they're beautiful and in truthfulness is what matters because you're going to look and read the book inside the inside of the book now let's look at the reversible jacket and also the hard cover this is the detail that has the front cover and finally this is isn't it beautiful she has such a strong face okay guys and so that was everything i hope that you really enjoyed me unboxing the two book boxes i did really enjoy the bookish one the illuminate i find it a little bit empty i don't know they are supposed to have always the same items the same um number of items or quantity of items but i didn't it didn't feel full um the bookish one i really enjoy and i really love the book that they sent me even though i have it already it doesn't matter because it's a different edition and I don't know, it feels like it's smaller than the um, either Fairy Loot or Illuminate. I do not remember who sent it to me. Um, but I did really enjoy that one because it is smaller. And I, again, loved the US cover more than the UK, which is so weird because it's always the other way around. For the book selection from Illuminate, I I don't know it's not fantasy so I'm not I wasn't planning on reading that book but now that I have it of course I'm going to read it but I don't know I feel like it was unexpected unexpected but it's not not enjoyable like I will read it and if it's good it is good I did not enjoy the color palette that they um, did I feel like I do not like that highlighter yellow that they did the edges in <laughs> but that's just my opinion you know I did love the items it had a lot of good items so yeah that is everything see you very soon